Resonator Guitar, My Personal History with Delta Six is for Guitar and Harley Benton Resoking. Hi guys, Irvisini from Chiang Mai, Thailand. Welcome to my music channel. Primero, Delta Six from East Good Guitar. In this video, I decided to put together snippets of my old Resonator Guitar videos and compare them with the guitar I still have today. The Delta Six from Eastwood guitar represents a particular period of my life. I stopped playing the guitar for 10 years because of recurring tidinitis problems. I switched to tuba during that lapse of time and the Delta Six was the guitar that got me back into the six strings. When I discovered this wood instrument, I was seduced by the mix of vintage instruments with modern technology. Because of the low price, I decided to order it and to start playing again. Here is the P90X pickup in clean sound. The Delta 6 piezo sucked so bad that I only reviewed the P90 neck pickup. The guitar played wonderfully, but at the time I decided to enter into the guitar building world and to only play with guitars I had built, so I sold it. Segundo, Harley Benton Resoking. I decided to get myself another resonator two years later, so I bought the Harley Benton Resoking guitar. This one. The instrument was comfortable to play, but the electronic was terrible, so I decided to apply my magic and to make it sound awesome. I changed everything and I built a GFL preamp that made all the difference in the world for the piezo pickup. As a rule of thumb, a piezo without a preamp cannot sound good. Building a GFL preamp is not the ultimate solution. However, you can install any piezo preamps for acoustic guitar or ukulele and get the same result or even much better. Also, with those preamps, you have an EQ, a presence, and a tuner. But the room required is not always available on a solid body or a semi hollow body guitar type. Here are snip sets using the neck pickup and the piezo pickup recorded in 2016. <laughs>
So this is neck pickup in parallel with the piezo, both together. If I do the same thing with only the piezo pickup, and if I do that with only the neck pickup, So now the same sound, the same pattern with the piezo pickup, same sound. together, neck pickup in parallel and the piezo, now only the piezo, same riff. And now the neck pickup alone in parallel. And in series. Both together. And neck pickup.
Because of this piece of metal, we cannot do any palm mute. Because if I... I added a Bill Larance EQ filter instead of a regular tone pot. In the down position, I have a standard 047 microfarad cap functioning as a conventional tone pot. I pull the ton pot up, I have a 1.5 Henry adapter kicks in, coupled with a 027 microfarad capacitor. <laughs> sound when I roll down the tone pot close to zero like this. Like this. On the mag magnetic pickup, I don't find it really interesting. But... If I want to have like a sound close to an acoustic guitar, this was, this is what I do. Otherwise, if I go like this on the piezo. way to play because you have like a, an electric feeling when you play but at the same time strings are feels more like an acoustic guitar so you can play more you can strum it more like an acoustic guitar and when you play when you pick R you have the same reaction as an acoustic guitar play like that on an electric guitar, let's say a Strat with 010, it doesn't work, it doesn't sound like that. When you play really hard. Welcome to my music channel. Yeah. Thanks for watching my video. Please don't forget to register and to hit the notification bell below.